What's unique about this tool is that you use a handle to actually line out your hole, then dig it out. This is how it works. Hiker Jay here. This week I'm going to be talking about a very important subject when it comes to wilderness, being in the wilderness and backcountry, a very sensitive topic, but important one, how to poop in the woods. A couple of things that I carry, mainly what I carry for going to the bathroom in the backcountry. And the two things I'm going to be talking about is my Deuce 2 trowel, which is amazing. They have some just, it's crazy how much technology has gone into this simple little trowel and I'll, I'll break it all down for you. And then the second piece is the wipes that I carry. These wipes are unique in a very special way compared to other wipes. Of course, they're biodegradable, but there's something else, and we'll talk about those towards the end. But first, we're gonna talk about the new and improved Deuce 2 shovel trowel. For starters, I'm gonna talk about the technology that goes into this shovel. It is quite amazing what they've put into a nice little trowel. And a lot of people might not wanna carry these, and that's why I wanna talk about how light and simple and functional this is so that you do carry it and you practice you know, good habits out in the wilderness. The main thing about the Deuce 2 is that it's so incredibly light. It is less than an ounce. It's 0.6 of an ounce, which is amazing. So you don't even feel, feel it when you have it. So there's no reason to not carry one of these. But let's talk about the technology that has gone into this. So the original Deuce actually was, the, the handle was straight and that didn't have these extra little grooves for gripping. And then it didn't have these extra little notches for digging. So that's pretty cool, they added those. But let's talk about the original design. So they, this is made out of aerospace aluminum. So it is really, really strong. It will bend and will break, but I mean, it is, it is really, really, really tough. So it'll hold up. And they've basically lined it and put these grooves in it so that that's where it gets its strength from. So from those grooves. A couple things though, you, you never wanna put it in and actually crank forward because that's bending with the groove and you can bend it. You're always cranking out, whether you're using it upside down or regular, and you do use it upside down. I'll show you that when I actually dig a little hole with it. Um, but a couple other features on this is that it's got this hole right here. Right off the bat, people think, well, that hole is just for hanging it on my pack or whatever, and you can. But this thing works great for pulling out a testy stake, stake in the ground, like a tent stake. So you can just stick it in there, grab the stake, and actually yank it out. Pretty sweet little thing. So it's a dual purpose item, which when you're thinking ultralight, that's always really important. So now, this is the second version. What I like about the second version is that they made three different sizes. Uh, this is the number two, so this is the middle size, but they have one that's smaller and a one that's a little bit bigger. I think going about it the next time, I'd actually get the three. Because it's so light, you don't even feel it, so it'd be nice to have something a little bit bigger. But I'd have to say that the two, when you put it in your hand and grip it and you're digging, it's not bad at all. So now, let me show you how to dig a proper cat hole or a hole to dispose of your waste. We'll go down to the ground here and I'll show you how they say that you should use this tool, which is kind of pretty unique and I like it. I, it does work the way that they say the instructions. So I did read the instructions, which is crazy, I know, but let's check it out. So what's unique about this tool is that you use a handle to actually line out your hole, then dig it out. This is how it works. So kind of clear your ground area and then you take the bottom, the actual handle, and you start to go around in a circle. Just like so. Then, what's nice is, you can just pop that big divot right out of the way. So that's basically, and you can dig away a little better once you're in there, make it a little bit deeper. Definitely don't go super shallow, that's the worst, because then the stuff just kind of gets dug up by animals because they smell it and they want to check it out. So you dig a nice big hole and then you can shove it all back in. So even like little roots like this, it cuts them really nicely uh, because it's not sharp in any way, it just has really good grooves and it can cut something like that right out of the way. Now that we got our hole dug and uh, ready to go, I'm gonna show you the wipes that I wanna show you, these biodegradable wipes that are pretty unique. So let's hop to that. All right, so now that we have our hole dug, let's talk about the actual wipes. These wipes are what they call combat wipes. I have a link to them down below in my Amazon affiliate, as I do with the trowel, and you can check them out. Of course, they're 100% biodegradable, and wipes are great in the wilderness. A lot of, you can use biodegradable toilet paper, and that's awesome, but it's white, and it really stands out. So why I like this is because these combat wipes are actually black. And so that, what's great about that, if they do get dug up or they peek out in some way, it's not gonna really show up in the actual environment here in the woods. And it's really thick. I mean, these things are 
awesome for you can tear it apart use it for a couple different things if you need to clean something up on camp not just for toilet paper and dispose of them properly or carry them out now they're really perforated because they are that biodegradable material so that they'll break down a little bit quicker in the environment when it comes to pooping in the woods wipes are awesome and these combat wipes are great in that they're they're black and they're also biodegradable so i would say if you're going to go backpacking make sure you take these two items take a trowel with you and take some biodegradable wipes you may not just use these for uh toilet paper use but you can use them for washing your hands and all different types of things but they are biodegradable and they're black so you don't really see them very well if you're if you're in your got your hole here and something's peeking out I mean, you can see how that just, I mean, I have black sticking out there, but it blends right into the environment instead of a white toilet paper sticking out if an animal digs it up or whatever. So on your next backpacking trip, go ahead and get yourself a trowel. It weighs next to nothing and get yourself some combat wipes that are in black because it really takes down the impact on the environment and doesn't ruin it for other people when they wake up and they're, you know, in their camp area and they go to go to the bathroom and you see a little piles of white toilet paper everywhere. That's terrible. We don't want that. So. Um, if you like this video, if you would, go ahead and hit like and subscribe. Till next time, just remember, life's a hike, so hike happy. Thanks so much for sticking around to the end of the video. If you're new to my channel, if you hit subscribe, that'd be awesome. I put out new videos every Thursday around outdoor gear. And if you'd like to support me, you can check out my merchandise. I have my Hike Happy shirt on here uh, at my store. You can click that down below and check out the other apparel that I have. Till next Thursday, just go ahead and watch some of my other videos.